Hi, I'm Lucas Nunes, and I'm here today to talk about the fusion models and how to scale it to real-world 3D LiDAR data and achieve scene completion. In an outdoor dynamic environment, the robot needs to understand its surroundings to be able to safely navigate through it. For self-driving cars, we usually use cameras, radars, and LiDARs to achieve that. For the LiDAR data, the data comes with unseen regions due to the LiDAR beam patterns and also due to occlusions in the scene. But for the robot, those errors are still quite relevant. For us humans, it may be easy to infer what should be on those missing errors, but for computer vision techniques, it is still quite challenging, especially when considering real world to the LiDAR data, which is much noisier. The central question behind scene completion is how to fill the missing data. Previous approaches have done that using sign distance field representations or by predicting occupancy over a voxelized scene. But in this paper, we rephrase the central question as can we generate the missing data? We can think of it as a generative task. Given a partial observation of the scene, we want to generate what is missing from it. And the answer is yes, and we do that using the fusion models. To give a quick background over the fusion, we first define a fixed number of T denoising steps, from which during the forward fusion, step by step, we sample the noise and iteratively add this noise to the data. Then we train a model to learn the inverse process, predicting the, mo the noise added at each step removing from the data such that in the end, in our case, we would arrive at a complete scene representation. The problem of scaling point fusion to real world 3D data comes from the point clouds. The data is quite noisy and also the object's representations change a lot depending on its distance to the sensor. Besides that, over the different axes in our point cloud, we have different scale of data. This is a problem because during the forward fusion, the Gaussian noise sample to be added to the data has the same scale over all the axes. Previous shape completion approaches have fixed that by first normalizing the input data before adding the, the noise to it, but this cannot be done to scene scale data, because if we normalize the scene over all the axes, we end up with this drastically distorted scene from which we lose information. Therefore, what we do is to reformulate the, the, the fusion process as a local problem. Instead of doing as previous approaches, where the noise added was always sampled at the origin of the data and then added to each point individually independent of the point through the location, we sample the noise around each point using the same standard deviation, but centered at uh, the point the location where the noise will be added afterwards. In this local formulation, the scene uh, data distribution is disentangled from the denoising process, leverage only the point local neighborhood distribution. Here is how we do. We start from a single LiDAR scan. We can generate the ground truth by aggregating a sequence of scans given its poses. Then we train our noise predictor by sampling a random step over the fixed number of denoising steps that we have and generate the noise point cloud at this sampled step. Then the model has to predict only the noise added at this given step. Of course, this noise point cloud has few structured information, so together we turn an encoder to extract features from the scene such that we can guide the denoising process towards the expected scene. Then during inference, replace the ground truth by the point cloud, a single LiDAR scan, add the noise to it, and we compute all the t-denoising steps, step by step, predicting the noise, removing from the data, until in the end, we arrive to a complete scene representation. But this representation is still quite sparse, as you can see, due to the uh, diffusion process computational uh, resource that it demands. So therefore, we train a second model to do a local upsampling of this prediction, such that we can arrive at this complete and dense scene representation. Our results show that our approach could achieve a more detailed scene reconstruction compared to previous scene completion methods and especially compared to previous point diffusion methods. And here you can see how it works. We start from a single LiDAR scan, we sample the noise around each point individually and add to the data. Then we use the noise predictor to predict the noise added and step by step remove it from the data. Then we use the local sample network to densify this prediction, arriving to this dense and complete scene representation from a single LiDAR scan. To summarize, in this paper we use diffusion models to achieve LiDAR scene completion. We reformulate the diffusion process as a local problem where we leverage only the local point neighborhood during the denoising process, which enables our method to be operational on real world 3D scenes. Our method could achieve a more detailed scene reconstruction compared to previous uh, scene completion methods and especially compared to previous point diffusion methods. If you find our work interesting, we invite you to check out our code in our paper in the links in the QR codes. Thanks.